Jerry Zanoy, 16 Presidents of Circle, Hampton. I'm here to speak on the Wright, uh, Wright Pierce report. I have some questions that I hope they answer when they get to the table uh, for their appointment. And uh, uh, and I looked at uh, the email I got from Fred that listed the 12 top items, and I looked at it uh, with some degree of intimacy here. Um, well, I'm going to start by saying that uh, the aeration and the ventilation are the two very most critical items, and ventilation seems to be getting covered as we go from the screening building to the grid building and the operations building, I hope. I didn't check that yet, but, but the aeration really gets me. Uh, table 2-1 on page 2-2 uh, shows me and tells me that we are really at, we are really at or exceeding state limits right now in terms of the BOD and total suspended solids. So we got some critical decisions to make with aeration. In 2003, the original process was changed. We were fully nitrated. But in 2003, because of a series of problems, I wasn't here. I don't, I don't know. I don't hear about them. I didn't hear about them. pH, alkalinity, filamous fibers. The process was changed to a modified process. And when that happened, the millions of gallons per day allowance dropped from 4.7 to 3.9, and so didn't the pounds per day output of T, T, uh, total suspended solids and DOD. So, <laughs> you know, we're now at the precipice, so to speak. My concern is, in reading this report, is that I'm getting mis mixed messages as to which process Wright Pierce supports. Uh, Page 313, under paragraph 3.41, speaks very strongly of, 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 you know, maybe returning to the original process and adding in some supplementary processes which would take care of the pH or the alkalinity factors. And on the, on other paragraphs, they're indicating that it's not going to make that much help anyway. We're going to have to aerate, aerate or have to need more tanks either way, sooner or later. So, and the other paragraph I will reference is uh, for, uh, page 4.6, or 4-6, uh, 424, paragraph 424, activated sludge aeration tanks. Uh, it says, for the town to continue operating with, the, with that modified process and maintain the design capacity of the wastewater treatment plant, additional tanks are going to be required. And, you know, of course, that goes with valving and bubblers and all the periphery that supports those tanks. Their high priority items on page 4-7 with respect to this activated sludge, I think, talks to the modified process, and I think they're supporting it and recommending this. But I'm not sure. And I've read this several times. So I need a hard readout from I need Wright Pierce to stand up and tell me, what process are they supporting? And then these are the items we need to do down here to, to support that process. The reason I picked on aeration, it makes up 47% of the 13.8 million. This is not an easy target here. You know, uh, you've got 13.880, and the aeration tank upgrade is 6 million six. That's 47, 48% of the whole bill right there. We got to know. We have to know. Now, here's, here's another problem that I brought up. I'm, I can't get into all these categories. I don't have the time. But there's been six reports published. The first one, 2011-2013. The second one, 12-15-2016. 12-15-2016 for another one. 12, uh, 12 uh, December 19, 2016 for another one. December 23rd, 16 for another one. And the last one, January of 2017. Six reports totaling 68 pages. Late December, last December, a year ago today, and in January 31st. And yet this Jerry, report... You're going to have to... Wind. Yeah, yeah, I'm finishing up. Okay. This report is dated September the 7th, 17th, and I don't think it became public for distribution until November. I might be wrong. So in, in closing, I'm going to say this. We have a very short runway, guys, for getting a $14 million bill passed, if you will, request. Very short runway. You've got January and February. 
Argument has to be convincing and believable and backed up with facts for every one of these items. Estimates on material that can be genuinely checked out on the Internet. Labor costs. Make it believable and make it convincing. You only have two months for that. My argument is maybe this report should have been in our hands six months ago. We might have had a better shot at it. Thank you very much Thank you. for your time.